cat bite and cat scratch disease. Both cat bite and cat scratch disease are caused by cats, but are two different entities. The cat bite will cause infection in about 30 to 50% of cases, while the dog bite will cause infection in about 2 to 5% of cases. There are more dog bites than cat bites or even human bites. Females are bitten more by cats, males are bitten more by dogs, Animal bites are common in children. Cat and dog bites usually affect the upper extremity more than the lower extremity, and there is always a delayed presentation. Usually the injury and the care is underestimated. Dog bites usually cause structural damage. The cat bites have a higher rate of infection more than dog bites because the cat has small, sharp, needle-like teeth that can puncture and cause deep wounds that can penetrate the bones, the joints, and the tendon sheath, especially the flexor tendon sheath. The puncture wounds sometimes seal up immediately and become unnoticed or underestimated, not obvious, and can cause septic arthritis, tenosynovitis, and can also cause osteomyelitis. It may take longer to initiate treatment in cat bites. What causes infection in cat bites? Delayed treatment for more than 12 hours, older age, puncture wound, host conditions such as diabetes or immunosuppressed patients. The most common bacteria isolated from cat bites is Pestrella, and the culture takes about one week to grow. The infection in cat bites is usually polymicrobial with more than one in a row. Pestrella is present in about 80% of cat bites. The Pestrella causes severe pain and the swelling in 48 hours. Treatment. If the patient is seen early, do irrigation in the emergency room if needed. Give tetanus toxoid, splint, give antibiotics, provide local wound care and observation. If the treatment is delayed, the patient may have infection such as abscess, septic arthritis, tenosynovitis, or osteomyelitis. The patient will need surgery for incision and drainage and cleaning the wound. Give antibiotics in cat bites, especially if injury to the hand, to the face, or the injury is severe or deep down to the bone. You give the antibiotics for three to five days. Augmentin is the antibiotic that's commonly used for cat bites. All cat bites should be covered with augmentin, regardless of the wound size. In cat bite, 50% of the patients will need surgery. How about cat scratch disease? Sometimes it's called cat scratch fever. Cat scratch disease is an infection that's transmitted by a cat's scratch. The lesion is small less than one centimeter. It is normally a benign, self-limiting illness lasting for about six to 12 weeks, and it is caused by exposure to Bartonella hensali bacteria. Timeline of events leading to cat scratch disease first begins with a scratch, and within one week, there is the development of skin lesion in about 50% of the patients. There will be noticeably enlarged lymph nodes within the first two weeks. Swollen lymph nodes with no other etiology and a scratch from being in contact with a cat could suggest the presence of a cat scratch disease. The physician should check for elevated sedimentation rate and CRP.
A positive skin test for cat scratch disease is important for establishing the diagnosis. What are the symptoms? The patient may have swollen or draining lymph nodes, fever, fatigue, headache. Swollen, tender or hard lymph nodes could be confused with a soft tissue tumor. Regional lymphadenopathy is a main clinical feature. It is a pseudotumor and should be considered in the differential diagnosis of soft tissue lesions. These areas of lymph node concentration include cervical lymph nodes, axillary lymph nodes, cubital lymph nodes around the elbow, it's called epitrochlear lymph nodes, and inguinal lymph nodes around the hip. Symptoms are self-limiting and can vary from mild to severe, lasting for several weeks. Treatment Antibiotics include doxycycline, cipro, and azithromycin. No biopsy is necessary. A biopsy will show lymphoid tissue and necrotizing granulomas. Thank you very much. I hope that was helpful.